Hello, my name is Adonis and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an X returns reading for all of my cancers out there. This is an X return reading for all of my cancers out there for the month of September 2019. So without any further ado, let's jump in and see what the cards have to say. Okay, Sun, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Sun, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. What kind of energy? Are my cancers dealing with what kind of energy are my cancers dealing with during the month of September? Okay. Okay. We got some things going on here. We got some things going on here. First out the gate, we got the two of wands. So right now, you got some decisions. You got some choices. You got some choices. You're kind of like, do I go this way? Do I go that way? So you're kind of like, you're kind of surveying the field, if you will. You're surveying the field, kind to, kind of trying to see what you see, so to speak. So with that being said, we got the pool card here, which says, it's a possibility that you're ready to take that leap of faith. You're looking to take that leap of faith. You know, you're, you, you're like I said, you're surveying the field. You know, you're kind of liking what you're seeing. So you're like, you know what? I think, I'm, I, think I may want to jump back into the saddle again. So you're like, you're, you're taking that leap of faith. You're going for it. And you're going for with a sense of newfound inner strength, inner passion, and the determination. So you got the spiritual strength. You got the passion to go for it. And that's, that's because, okay, it's not for not, because you've got this water sign individual, a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio, and this Ace of Cups is, boom, deep, passionate, true, 100% love. And so you're taking a leap of faith towards something that looks to be the genuine article, okay? There's nothing fake about this. This is 100% pure love here. Um, you're willing to give it to them and take a leap for it and they're giving it back to you. So you're liking, you're liking the way this is feeling. You like the vibe of this, vibe of this situation. So you're going to go for it, which is smart. Okay. If I do say so myself. So with that being said, you also, you got this page of pentacles to this earth sign individual. Again, uh, could be younger, could be a younger individual. Uh, could it be a person just kind of younger at heart, pretty much? Um, again, it's an earth sign individual, a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Taurus. Um, and this, again, Page of Pentacles kind of moves very specific. They're sending very specific messages. They're, they're careful about the messages that they're sending you, okay? Um, uh, however, there's a potential third-party situation with this earth sign person here. So you may want to... Watch your six on that, for sure. Um, you know, they're being very careful about the messages that they're sending you is because um, they're probably trying to make sure that the messages that they're sending you are going to contradict, contradict the messages that they're sending somebody else. <laughs> so, um, they kind of they kind of got, they're kind of playing two wins against the middle here. They're sending you one thing and, and, and letting you know, hey, yo, this is what's going on with you. Then at the same time, to kind of talking to somebody else and kind of, you know, talking a little bit of stuff to them too. If anything can be said, at least they're being smooth about it, right? They're being smooth about it. So you got to give them credit for that. So, but you still may want to watch your six with this, with this earth sign individual here. All right. And then finally here, we have this air sign individual, king of swords. Now this person, um, you know, an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. Um, this person is a very has a very very solid foundation. They, you know, a very strong individual, very solid foundation. But um, you're not the only game in town, okay? And because you got the you got the three of wands out there, they put some feelers out there to some other individuals, and they're kind of just waiting to see what comes over the horizon. And you just happen to be one of the many. Um, and, and to be honest with you, um, 
you know, they kind of consider, you know, even having to kick it to you the way that they have, you know, because they probably had to try, they probably had to come correct with you because you're an individual of quality and or uh, because they know that there's this huge possibility of this water sign individual that truly beginning to occupy your space, occupy your time, and really giving out really positive, good vibes so they can see, wow, you know, this person is pretty much drifting away from me. So let me kind of kick my game up a little bit. And they're, they're, they're kind of view it as it's kind of burdensome, like, damn, you know, I thought I had this, but now I got to kick my game up. So that's when you get the, you, you, that's when you get the, the, ten of, the Ten of Wands here. It's kind of problematic. It's rather burdensome to them. Okay, so that's what's going on with you. So let's see what's going on. What kind of energy you got going on with your ex over here? What kind of energy are you dealing with with your ex? Okay, what kind of energy is going on with your ex? What kind of energy? What kind of what? What's going on with uh, what's going on with my cancer's ex? What kind of energy is my cancer's ex dealing with? What kind of energy are my cancer's ex dealing with? What kind of energy are my cancer's ex dealing with? Show me cards I need to see. Show me cards I need to. Mm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Oh, wow. Okay, so there is the Knight of Pentacles that your ex is dealing with at the moment. Um, and again, this person. Knight of Pentacles, very, um, very reasonable, very responsible, very deliberate too. Very, very deliberate. They're making, they're, de they're deliberately moving in a specific direction to get a specific outcome. Not unlike the a Page of Pentacles that kind of takes care. Of, but Knight of Pentacles is more, a little bit more specific, a little bit more methodical in their movements. So. Um, and, and, and so they're moving they're moving towards an end goal here and again they're reasonable responsible they're reliable um, and, and, and they're grounded so they're moving towards your ex here and there's a lot of energy just really really you know a lot of messages a lot of energy this seems to be like something that's significant because we have the four of wands here which tells me that this is the real deal this person is thinking long-term, hardcore relationship, long-term relationship, possible marriage. So this is definitely something that is very, very, very legitimate. Very legitimate. Um, and with that being said, we got the Four of Swords here. So the Four of Swords tells me that, um, you know, uh, there's been a lot of thought put behind this. There's a lot of reflection, contemplation, and there's this overall sense of calm. An overall sense of calm. The way that it it, 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 it things are kind of rolling out in a very calm, deliberate fashion. Okay, so there's a, there's a calm in here. There's no rushing here. They're taking their time. They're dying their eyes. They're crossing their T's. They're putting the commas in the right place. So this is something that is, is progressing over a period of time, and it's going to possibly lead to something that is legit. All right, now, with that being said, there's also this water sign individual, okay? Again, Cancer, uh, Scorpio, or Pisces. Now, again, Ace of Cups, deep, true, passionate love. You're dealing with one, but so are they. And this person, um, this person feels as though like, hey, we're fulfilled here. My wishes, their, their wishes are being fulfilled. They're, it's like literally, um, you know, they're, 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 they got everything. Be, being with this individual fulfills all of their dreams, um, completes them as a person. So this is really something that's really um, some really seriously le legitimate passion here that's going to be wish fulfillment for, for this particular situation um, for your ex here. So, that, you know. There's some, there's some good things going on here. There's some good things going on here. And finally, we have another Earth sign. We have an Earth sign individual here. Another Earth sign. Okay. Again, a 
Taurus, a Capricorn, or a Virgo. Um, and it is a really huge opportunity. Um, this looks like, again, an another big, solid opportunity uh, that something is really going to take hold here. The reason I say that is because we got the Wheel of Fortune. So, um, it appears as though, you know, the Wheel of Fortune is also uh, beginning to kind of turn in their favor. Um, and they re really begin, they're beginning to get some traction. So, you know, this month, man, you know, this month really, your ex got it going on for real. I mean, like, this, your ex is really... Got a lot of great opportunities of of, 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 of of real solid commitment here. Okay? So that's what's going on with them. So, of course, the $25,000 question is, what's the chances that you guys are going to get back together this month? Okay? Um, yeah. So... What are the chances that, um, show me cards I need to see, what, what are the chances that um, my cancers are going to get back together with their ex this month? What are the chances that my cancers are going to get back together with their ex this month? Show me cards I need to see, show me cards I need to see, show me cards I need to see. Man, I did not see that coming. Sorry to keep you in suspense for a second. So. You guys kind of take a break. You guys, you know, rest, relaxation, contemplation, kind of. You let things ease up a little bit, kind of things kind of slow down a little bit. So there's a sense of, there, there's a sense of, think the, the waters are calm. Okay. Got the King of Cups here. So there's a sense of generosity, gener generous, wise choices, wise decisions when it comes to being generous, being courteous. So that's, you know, so you got that this is civil, civility here. It's calming. This civility. Okay. Boom. Didn't see that coming. I mean... With your ex having all of these potential things going on, I thought for sure that um, there was no way that they were going to come back over this way. But, hell yeah, and in a big way. This is a big fat yes, 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 yes. So, uh, yeah, um, they're, they're going to be coming over your way for sure. I would say this is an absolute yes. Um... Yeah. So let's see. Let's see. If the spirits have any additional information to offer about this particular situation. I would be interested actually in seeing the additional information spirits have to offer. Actually, because I, you know, I I did not see that coming. I really did. So, okay, Let's do it this way. And this is interesting. This is interesting. So, you guys are going to get back together. But, okay, this is how these things play out. Again, this is a story. All right? So, you got some good things going on. They got some good things going on. But you guys are still going to kind of find your way back to each other. But, spirit don't lie. There's something better. And that's for you. Um, you know, there probably is some nostalgia, some unresolved feelings that you guys um, have with each other, for sure. Um, but, again, they have some pretty good things going on over their side to kind of like move in a different direction and you got a pretty, a pretty good situation going on with you too. And so, again, Spirit's saying there's something better. There's something better out there for you. 
Um, and to double down on that message, reconsider. You may want to reconsider getting back with your ex at this point because there, there's something better out there for you. Um, and, you know, finally we got the comprom compromise. If, 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 um, if you guys do end up getting back together, it's going to have to be, it's going to definitely be a sense of compromise. But like I said, this is kind of remarkable because like I said, you got some good things going on on your side. They got some really good things going on their side. But again, that nostalgia of, you know, I wonder what could have been. I wonder what if, you know. And um, as the old saying goes, is sometimes the grass isn't greener on the other side. You've moved on. And sometimes when you move on, you know, um, at least in this case, um, you move into a better situation. And it seems like you have. But it does appear that you guys have some unfinished business. So, you know, you guys will probably get back together. But, you know, uh, Spirit just wanted you to know that there is something out there that's better. So, and you should reconsider. But it does appear that you guys will be getting back together this month. But again, free will. Very, very important. Free will here. So, with that being said, I'm going to shut this thing down. Again, this was a general love reading. General love reading. Um, hopefully this resonated with you. Um, if it did, please feel free to get a personal reading. I'll leave all the links and stuff below. Um, if it didn't resonate with you, you still may want to get a personal reading so I can dig into your partic particular situation and pretty much maybe give you some advice on what you need to do to, to either resolve the, the issue or to give you a sense of relief. Um, but remember, I give it to you straight. So if you come to me for a reading, I'm not going to be asking you. I'm going to give it to you straight. So if you, if you just want to, somebody's going to blow smoke up your ear, I'm not your guy. If you're looking for somebody that's going to legitimately tell you how it is, then I'm the person you come to. All right? That being said, I love you guys so much. Um, please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Bye-bye.